the, with the, T, T, Babies, come on in the room. It's room 1420. Isis Jones with you, and it's time for Foodies with the T. Sure. No, you heard us on the radio. True. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody got um, a bop going on then. You know what? I, I love that we can get together um, from 7 till 10 um, and just swap stories because sometimes I don't get the opportunity to check out the news. There are two stories that we're going to feature tonight. One, a new Speaker of the House. Am I? Is, did I hear you correctly, Toy? Is that is that what you said? We have a new Speaker of the House. Yes, we yeah, do. And not only do we have a new Speaker of the House, okay, but we have our first African American Speaker ah. of the House. So let's kudos for that for the progression that's going on. In, Thank God, the party. Pelosi dropped out. You, oh, you know what? So Hakeem Jeffries is from Brooklyn, New York, Hakeem. and it was a yes, it was a it's giving Wakanda vibes. <laughs> it's a what? It's, it's giving, giving coming, Wakanda vibes. It's giving coming to America. It really is. It's, it's, it is. Hakeem. <laughs> Come on now. He, he a light bright though, baby. He ain't those. You know. Aww. But <laughs> I knew it was a, it was a something. But he was unanimously voted in as the House Speaker uh, for the Democrats. So it's very exciting to see. Is he cute? He is. He fine. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Fine. And you know, I don't do the light bright. He fine, baby. Oh. He give an old man fine. Uh, it's, it's almost kind of like on the Barack level. Well, he ain't as fine as Barack. Okay. But it's kind of like, you know, I'll send you the picture. Okay, I get you. Okay. I got you. But, yeah, so kudos to Mr. Jeffrey. Mm. Congratulations, Zaria Orders. <laughs> this is a first. <laughs> there is a woman, I know you probably have already heard the story out there, but there was a, well, it's not even a sister, it's a woman that is basically claiming that she's going to file a $3 million lawsuit against Kraft Macaroni and Cheese because with the instant uh, mix, it takes more than three and a half minutes to actually put this whole concoction together. So she's suing, saying that it's, you know, false advertising and that they need to change that. And better yet, she's just suing them for $3 million. No, it's five. It's five? Five million. She's suing Velveeta. It's the Velveeta uh, portion of the mac and cheese that comes in the cup. And you microwave it. Which are nasty. Let me just let me just let me just throw that Wait out. Wait a minute. She's talking about the microwavable. Yes, the microwave my, uh mac and cheese. She probably ain't putting enough water in it. Uh, my her microwave I, probably don't I have see. enough water. In the, in Period. That, she gonna get ate up in court, okay? Because there's gonna be a whole bunch of well, what kind of microwave are you using? Right. What year it's is it? It's probably got roaches in it. I don't know. I hope not. I really hope not. Allegedly. 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 Okay. But it is a Florida woman who is doing them for five million dollars. You know what? That would be Florida. That would be Florida. So we could just really pretty much sue over anything. You can find the loophole. You can definitely file for it. Period. I am filing a lawsuit against Nike and all these other shoe companies. For what? Be because if women can go and buy men's shoes, we should be able to go and buy women's shoes in our size. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And I mean, I, that's how is, all the Jordans get bought up. The women buy all the, because a lot of them don't come in women's sizes. Well, women's shoes, per se. You know how they genderize them. So they will buy all the men's that they can get in their size. But when they have a nice looking shoe that's a woman's shoe that might not look like a woman's shoe, but it's just nice, we can't go and buy, and they don't carry a 13 in women. I mean, in men's for women, so which I think would be a 15. Okay. They do, but you have to order them specialty. You can't, they don't have it on the site. Like when you go to Nike, they don't have those extra sizes. But we need to hook, we need to get you in contact with somebody at the WNBA to find it's, out it's, how they keep they shit. What you, because what you're not going to do is come for Nike. <laughs> you got some big, but ass. you can't come out right. with a women's shoe no. that say that these are no. women's. And then you can't no. have it in every in all the women's no. houses. Why are you stopping at twelve? No, we gonna we gonna keep some thought that. Okay, so with that said, when I get my money, no, I'm trying, trying to hit me up Monday through Friday. Where I'm can be we like, you find ain't my you once? Okay, <laughs> you're telling everything. Where can we find Joe? 
Behind you can find it. us at our website, www.foodieswiththet.com. All I'm going to say is, when I get this check, you ain't going to be my auntie. Toya ain't going to be my cousin. Because they ain't supporting me. I need some legitimate support like y'all supporting Kanye. Rally behind oh, me in this. Oh. Bye. All right. All right. We're going to see you tomorrow. It's B94.9 WATV. Twan on Let's see. Father God.